Guys, welcome back to another unboxing with Tony's phone collection. This is a phone lot that cost me 20 bucks on eBay with free shipping. And I actually only bought it because of this one Alltel device that I do not have. So that is the only reason I actually bought this all was for that one. The rest was just kind of extras. I probably already have all the other ones, but I figured we'd go and find out and see if we do or not. Might have a couple drop tests coming soon, maybe. Got bubble wrap, which I always like having bubble wrap, so let's go ahead and open these. Alrighty, and these ones we have two LG chocolate touches. Is the first one. This one looks in really good shape. I have one that has the uh, red, or not the red, the uh, purple back. This one doesn't have a battery, but at least I got one with a black back. And then this one will probably do a drop test, maybe, because it looks like it's got some pretty bad indentions in the. Uh, Resistive touchscreen, so I don't expect it to work, but we shall see. And also, we have this Motorola Droid. I think it's the first gen, maybe. Yeah, the Droid 1. The A855 with Verizon. No battery, no back cover, so hopefully it works. There's those two so far, or those three. This one, let's take a look. I right, there's another Envy. So, probably going to do a drop test on one of these Envies. Probably the worst condition one, which is probably this one. Um, I've been getting a lot of Envies recently. I don't know why. This seems to be, I guess, a popular phone to have. So, there's those ones. So here's the first one, the Envy. I guess we can go and see if the rest of these have any power. I guess they don't have batteries. Um, I didn't see the volume button is kind of hanging out. So that's kind of great. Um, looks like it's missing the little charging port door. Looks like the charger port is probably damaged. Missing the flap on the micro SD card. Looks to be in pretty bad shape overall. The battery shows heavy signs of wear. It's a, remo re uh, a refurbished unit. There we go. Um, looks like it's cracked right there, too. I don't think my other interviews have that. There's another one. Oh, I guess it does. Um, looks to be pretty beat up. Like I said, looks like it'd be a refurbished unit, so nothing too special on it. Here is a LG. I don't think I have this one. It's a LG VX3200. Maybe I do. It does sound kind of familiar. Looks to be in decent shape. Keep it doesn't look all yellow like some of these LGs, so that's pretty cool to have. And then we got bubble wrap. <laughs> We have the Samsung Smooth, which is the SEH U350. I'm pretty sure if I can remember. Yep, U350 with Verizon. I already have the uh, the Alltel version um, in pink, a blue one, and a Verizon blue one. So really don't need that one, but it was included. Here's an LG VX8300. Looks to be a refurbished unit. Most of them don't have this really weird looking sticker on them um screen is showing some kind of glue delamination or something probably going to be a drop test phone maybe looks like it has water damage like a rusty that screw looks and that one down there as well doesn't yeah it does have a water indicator and it is red so and then the last one or last two i should say uh let's see So here we go. Here is the LG AX4270. Um, this one's actually in really good shape. 
Um, I've already done a drop test on a couple of them. Or actually on one of them. I've done a couple other things. But this one's actually in really good shape. Probably going to keep this one in the collection as well. Like, look, that screen has no wear on it. Keypad looks beautiful. It's pretty interesting to see that one. And then the LG Wave, which is the AX380, if I remember right. Yep, the 380. I bought this lot because of this phone because I can't find it anywhere else. I found it on Macari, but he was wanting like 30 bucks for it. And I paid 20 bucks for this whole lot, so um, I'd rather just take my chances on this one. And it's kind of got like a shadow fade color. Looks to be in good shape. LCD doesn't look to be broken, so. There's unboxing, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. And stay tuned for the next one.